We waste phosphorus through our rubbish bin. We waste phosphorus through animal manure. We waste phosphorus through the sewage systems. When phosphorus disappears from the food chain, it becomes a threat to the environment. Phosphorus leaks into nearby water from wastewater and animal manure. The leaked phosphorus promotes the growth of algae. As a result, the amount of oxygen in the water decreases. This causes fish and other aquatic species to die. We call this process eutrophication. In Europe, we have a Baltic Sea which faces eutrophication. And indeed, it's not just a problem of the sea, but it's a problem for us humans. Because making other species disappearing, losing natural resources, or bringing in the pollution which kills, is like losing our own place on the planet. But we don't just have water quality problems in the Baltic Sea. Excess nitrogen and phosphorus is a problem all across the EU especially where we have intensive animal production. We have made some progress in terms of urban waste water treatment facilities or in terms of the banning of phosphate detergents, for example. But there remains a lot to do. Excess phosphorus is not simply an environmental problem. It's also creating economic damage to our fisheries, or to uh, our tourism sector where uh, we have uh, problems with algae. We need to use phosphorus more efficiently and we need to recycle it more and we need to do so urgently. The technologies and the opportunities already exist. Simply we need to move to action. We have to take action today. Join the search for solutions and opportunities on the online platform 